When you're dealing with creation, you are dealing with your own emotions and other people's emotions, and we all communicate differently. And text messages and emails, as we know, are probably not the best way to get creative ideas across. Yeah. But you're convenient for communicating. And as a result, oftentimes we can really feel crushed by, mm. you know, I can send something off and I get an emoji that's like a thumbs up or a thanks. And I don't know what that means. I don't mean, do you like it? Do you hate it? Does this mean everybody has to listen to it and they're gonna, they've got to evaluate it? Am I gonna get three pages of notes back? I don't know what that means. Whereas, um, you know, I've gotten critique back that was very lengthy and I interpreted it one way and I completely felt destroyed over it. Mm. And come to find out that was either, maybe that's what they meant, but in other situations, it wasn't what they meant. And I was completely beating myself up over it. My confidence is shaken. And it, it just came down to the fact that just that communication as far as how we, you know, just how we communicate that way. And so I think that that's the other aspect that's, that's challenging is how you deal with that criticism and how you incorporate that and then either improve upon or whatever the case might be. Mm.